know, so many folks in the new year are trying to get themselves fit, trying to change their lifestyle, their eating habits, trying to exercise more, trying to meditate more. And so it's all about uh, having uh, a healthy temple. And of course, uh, I told you that I started uh, this cleanse uh, with uh, D herbs uh, at the uh, beginning of the year, uh, actually uh, about 10 days ago. Uh, and so this is the third time that I've done it. And so of course, D herbs is one of our partners here at Roller Bart on the Filter. And so we want to have a conversation with the CEO of the company, uh, Dr. A.D. Dolphin. Doc, how you doing? Hey, I'm doing great. So let's let's so let's talk first of all. Uh, what what is the health value of a cleanse? What does it do for you? It's going to help you clean out your system. Now, what does that mean? That means like basically, you're, over time, your body can develop gook in its system, and it's going to help you remove it in simplest terms. And so, um, and that's based upon uh, the stuff that we eat, so, oh, so that we absolutely. consume. Just think about the things that we eat, our environment, the pollution, the things we drink, the sugary drinks, the alcohol, all these things have a certain buildup, and this allows your body to remove it. Okay. And so, uh, so you have, what, two cleanses, 10-day and 20-day? We actually have 27 cleanses. Okay, got it. <laughs> but these, this is the cleanse that you would basically start off with, which is the 20-day and also the 10-day. Okay. Either one. All right. So when we talk about uh, the uh, these cleanses, so let's just let's go over here. So here are the various um, um, pills that we take. The first of all, right. there are six different uh, pills. So we got cardiovascular, kidney, bladder, and adrenals, blood and lymphatic, lungs and respiratory, colon and digestive tract, liver, spleen, and gallbladder. Yes. Okay. So now, now uh, you developed this. Yes. And so it, 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 it was based on what? Uh, why did you say, you know what, I really need to develop the, this cleanse? Well, these are based upon your basic eliminative channels. So these are the eliminative channels men and women are both going to have. So therefore, the cleanse is fit for both. Okay, and so you take these pills, uh, five pills, uh, one uh, one set uh, each day for a total of thirty pills. Yes. And so what? So by taking these and then drinking lots of water, what is it actually doing? What is it doing to your body? What What is it? Describe that process. Okay, so basically what it's going to do for each one of those individual organs that it speaks of, that it's going to actually help provide more energy so that particular organ can do more for your body, allowing it to clean out itself. Okay, and so our body also removes stuff in, in what different ways? So, we, I mean, obviously... It's... Yeah, so you got your skin. Your skin is the biggest organ in your body. More things actually pass through your skin than your actual bowels. And then, so that's one way. Then we got other, other things as far as breathing, your respiratory system. Then, of course, the other one is your, you know, going to the restroom. Okay, and so, and on, on this cleanse, uh, it's, uh, it's it's all raw, so raw vegetables, but also fruits. Yes, fresh fruits and vegetables, raw nuts and raw seeds. So you're on a raw food diet. Okay, and when you're taking these, uh, when you talk about the, uh, so I got to ask you this. I was uh, I posted a photo on YouTube. Okay. Uh, of uh, a fruit plate that I had for um, uh, for breakfast. Right. And then of course, you know, everybody think, thinks they're they're doctors, <laughs> and supposed to go on. Oh my God, that's way too much sugar. You know what? I always try to tell people, people don't understand that there's a lot of studies now that, when, especially when people uh, talk about the sugar issue, is that if you actually go raw, you can help turn diabetes 1, type 1, you can actually change that for yourself. You got to remember, God put this stuff on the planet. This stuff is not going to hurt you. This is not pharmaceutical drugs in any way, shape, or form. These are natural sugars that your body can withstand. So, it, so it's not processed, and so there you and again, go. So I, I'm not. First of all, I'm not a vegetable person. Okay, <laughs> I mean, my wife knows it, my family knows it. Right. I can't stand vegetables. Right. So my whole deal is, okay, thank God for fruits. <laughs> uh, thank God that I can actually eat pineapples, blackberries, blueberries, strawberries, raspberries. Right. Uh, are bananas allowed? Absolutely. Okay, bananas, green apples. There you go. Uh, I'm trying to think. Watermelon. Any fruits and vegetables that your heart desires, you can have on this clan, and there's no limit on the amount of food that you can eat. And then, uh, and then, and the nuts is good. For the, first of all, I've, I've hated nuts my, all my life. I mean, I just <laughs> did so. I, I, I forced myself, I said, out of all the nuts, to tolerate uh, pecans. Okay. Uh, and then, and luckily, uh, they have uh, it's uh, the the, the Salela, Sahela, I think it's called mixed. I got some in my office. Right. So basically, it's uh, it's like. Cherry is like cherry, almond, 
apple and pecan okay. in that mix. Okay. Thank God for that. Right. Okay, so, uh, so there's a little sweetness to it. But but the thing about it is, it, but this is also, again, it's a process, process. It's a mind of a matter because, I mean, look, you know, you want to eat meat or you want to eat cereal or whatever. And so right. it's like training yourself, okay, I cannot have that. I cannot, okay, I just got to stay away from it. But you got to kind of keep in mind that you were trained, you were already programmed. You're programmed now that you need eggs, you need pancakes, you need these things. So you actually have to go through a reprogramming of yourself. Fruits and vests, especially fruit in the morning, is great for your body because it's mm -hmm. going to give your body that energy that it needs to get through the day. If you ever notice, when you eat a breakfast, especially a heavy breakfast, it tends to tone you down. It tends to make you tired because now your body has to take time to process that. This is going to keep but, you but moving. Also, but also for the people who don't understand, I mean, uh, the the traditional large breakfast right. was meant for a different society. That was when folks were working in manufacturing facilities and in plants or working out in fields and so you were you, you burned that breakfast <laughs> off by the time lunch came no that's really true we definitely live in a different lifestyle currently but actually your largest meal should be lunch okay why is that so why why is the largest meal lunch the largest meal is lunch because first of all you don't want to get too sluggish in the beginning of your day and you don't want to get too sluggish before you go to sleep because of the fact that you don't want all that on your body prior mm -hmm. to sleep so the best time to have the biggest meal of the day, which is in the middle of the day, which is lunchtime. Okay, so so I'm on this 20-day cleanse. Okay, well, let me also go over this. Okay. Uh, what is <laughs> the absolute, what is the value of carbon activated charcoal? Oh, because my Because I God. can tell you it's horrible drinking it, but what's the value? And, I, and I'll, I'll be perfectly honest, <laughs> I'll be perfectly honest with you, I have not tried it. No, I've tried it before, but okay. on this cleanse, I have not tried it. I said, you know what? I'm gonna have to ask him before I. You know what? What's, are, what's the you, value of it? You are making the biggest mistake by not taking that. What does Let this me do? tell you that. So anytime anybody that goes to the hospital and they're suffering from any kind of overdose, that's what they give them. Okay. Because it pulls all of the poisons out of your gut. So the things that the aspirins, the pharmaceutical drugs that you've taken in the past, all that 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 history, it pulls it out of your gut, and then you're gonna take formula number six, and in the morning you're gonna rid yourself of that waste. So I take so I do this before number six? Huh? No, you this is the last part right. of but in the morning, number six is the one that makes you go in the morning. So this is the last thing that you number take. Number six, uh, that's so this is added. number seven. No, 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 it's the uh, colon formula. See, formula number six, the colon formula. Right, but that's that's 7 p.m. Right, but then you're gonna take this prior to going to sleep. No, no, I got it, I got it. Okay. So what you're saying is, you're taking the formula number six right. before, and then you're gonna take this, but when you wake up in the morning. It's gonna flush it all out. There you go, with the colon digestive tract. Got it, got it. Because I, I was sitting there going. It's just black. It's black, but it doesn't have a flavor at all. Right. It's a little bit, it's a little grainy, but that's it, okay, the no only, flavor. The only, only thing that I would suggest, okay, okay. this is just y'all, <laughs> as, as, as a consumer from packaging. The only other problem is that once you open this, Right. The problem is it gets all over the place. It does. It can. So if you're not aware of the situation. So I'm glad you're exposing this to people because that's one of the products that you got to treat with a little bit of care. You got to just take your time, open it, set it to the side. Okay. So so here's the question. Okay. So uh, so I have enough here. Go go through the 20 day cleanse. Right. I have not used it yet. Okay, so let's say when the 20 day cleanse is over. Okay. Okay, do, can I still keep doing this? Absolutely, in Africa, you know what they do with activated charcoal? It's a natural teeth whitener. So you can actually brush it on your teeth. I know it's black, but it's actually gonna clean your teeth. What, so you can put, so you, are you saying? Put a little toothpaste on it, you dip it inside, you brush your teeth really? with it, it's gonna help whiten your teeth. And, and along with that process, we already know, it's gonna pull the poisons out of your gut. What, when, so, uh, before this, what were you doing? Before this, uh, what on, I was on doing? On the medical side. On the medical side, nothing. I wasn't doing anything on the medical side. I ran several businesses my whole entire life. So I had a real estate company. I had a, a, a training business that taught kids how to play basketball. I've had, um, I've had probably every business under the sun. So where, so where did this come from? Where did this come from? I actually met an herbalist that I really liked. 
and you know I began gaining weight when I was uh, um, after I stopped playing basketball I used to play ba professional basketball in Australia and I and I gained weight and I, and I did the cleanse and it changed me it really did it had a profound effect on me and then so then I started doing everyone's cleanse and then then I, I noticed that I had such a wonderful experience. I said, felt like all of them had something missing. Mm -hmm. So I needed to add, I, I felt like I could put together a cleanse. So therefore, I, I hired an herbal team. Mm -hmm. And I found an herbalist that I really, really liked. And we began to put together this product. And this product has been in existence for the last 15 years. Mm -hmm. And we're the number one selling cleanse on the planet. Um, I uh, have, so in the, so be on it now, 10 days, so I've right. lost about 12 pounds and so uh in your in your brochure you say folks lose anywhere from 10 to 30 pounds right depending on the condition of your body so if you're already in amazing shape then you're not going to have that same experience mm -hmm. but if you're the average american the average american 70 percent of the average americans are obese so they are going to lose between 10 to 30 pounds for sure okay and so so once you go through the cleanse um they okay you're done right you're done and folks want to run out uh, and get them a slab of ribs. Okay, <laughs> what, what do you then tell them that they should do uh, so, once the cleanse is over to, to sort of, because you, you, you bit on this, this raw fruits and vegetables, right. but now you can eat whatever, but what do you tell them to do? So after you finish the cleanse, this is, this is probably the most amazing experience that you could have, because now you get to pick your diet. Because the things that you used to be addicted to, you're no longer addicted to. The things that you used to be drawn to, you're no longer drawn to them. This allows you to pick your diet. A lot of us didn't pick our diets. Our parents picked it for us. So this gives you the opportunity, because you're not so addicted to those things anymore, to pick the diet that you want to live. It, has, it gives you the ability to choose your new lifestyle. So, but, but, but the point is, you don't want people just losing their mind and just, just going you and, won't. and getting a three and a four piece and everything you else. You won't. After you go through this experience, it's like climbing Mount Everest. You're not going to turn around and, ju <laughs> and just jump out the window again. No, nah, you're going to take it slow. You just lost 30 pounds. Now you're feeling great. You have more energy than you've ever had. You're trying to find a way to actually retain that feeling. Now... Um, how, how often do you recommend folks doing a cleanse? I know some people who do it once a year. Right. Uh, I've heard others who do it two or three or four times a year. Is that what it is? Absolutely. Some people do it every seasonal change. That's what you're referring to. Uh, referring to. Um, you got some people who do it once a year. So it really depends on how well you eat. If you eat very poorly, do as often as you can because you can do it as much as you can. This is not a normal cleanse. Most cleanses, they say, where you have to drink some special concoction. You have to starve yourself. You don't have to do that. You can eat as much as you like mm -hmm. on this cleanse. We're just trying to get you to eat healthier foods. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, of the folks who've done it, what kind of changes have you actually seen? Oh, man. God, I've seen people that's, uh, you know, suffering uh, from things. Their body begins to recover. I've seen people um, lose. I've seen people lose up to 42 pounds on one cleanse in 20 days. Wow. I've seen people have more energy than they ever had. I've seen people, I mean, the list goes on. It really, it really depends on what you're going through, what your, what your experience is going to be. Okay, and I got to say this, so when you say you have the, the regimen, so take right. the first one at 7 a.m., right. but you also say take the last one at 7 p.m. That's always an issue for me because of my work schedule. Right. So I actually w wake up later, so typically uh, I might wake up around 9 or 10. Uh, or like, for instance, when I do my Time Joiner segment, it's Mondays and Wednesdays, it's at right. 7, but then I go back to sleep because, again, I'm, I'm doing my show from 6 to 7 uh, evening. Uh, is part of this also you're trying to get people not to not to eat late? No. Actually, this is built for the average person. So it's not necessarily built for you. Because some people have, you know, they wake up yeah. at, they have to be at work between 9 and 8, and they go to sleep around 10. It's for that person. But you can always adjust the time of the, uh, the schedule when you're supposed to take the capsules. Why two to three hours a gap? Because that's how long it takes you to process food within your system. Okay. All right, then. Well, Doc, uh, we certainly appreciate it. Uh, we'll definitely see what happens at the end of the 20 days. Uh, it has <laughs> been uh, quite interesting, uh, all, the, uh, all the fruits. And, uh, but I will say this here. 
thank goodness for fruit smoothies where I can actually take uh, that spinach or organic mix uh, of green stuff that I normally <laughs> would not eat and at least put it in a blender and put it with some fruit and I can actually drink it. There uh, you go. So JJ uh, Smith and her green smoothie, she actually got me started on that because before I'm like, I'm not doing this. <laughs> but Doc, we appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Absolutely. All right. Well, check out Roller Martin Unfiltered. YouTube.com forward slash Roland S. Martin. And subscribe to our YouTube channel. There's only one daily digital show out here that keeps it black and keep it real. It's Roland Martin Unfiltered. See that name right there? Roland Martin Unfiltered. Like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. That's YouTube.com forward slash Roland S. Martin. And don't forget to turn on your notifications so when we go live, you'll know it.